I have bespoke post with me again today. I'm ghosting them. <laughs> you may actually get something different based on your profile. Your trail box is here. Here we go. I don't even need this for camping. This will come handy for lawn work around, around the house. I just got something like this for my college student. I, I'm pretty sure I know the answer is no. <laughs> don't feed the animals. It's a really neat little outdoorsy hiking style bracelet. And it has a little cutout here so you can hang it on your belt. I have a feeling my husband will be using most of these items and that is fine with me. Everything in here is really well made. Hello, welcome back to my subscription box life. I am so glad that you could join me today. I have bespoke post with me again today. This is my second box from bespoke post. I subscribed to them just because I was super curious about what they were all about. And I had read a bunch of reviews and I decided I just wanted to try it for myself. It's an interesting subscription. Um, it's advertised more of like a membership. You can um, purchase, it's a month to month, but you have the option to skip a box, um, cancel whenever you want. And you also have the option to switch your box. They will send you an email to let you know what box they are planning to send you. And if you don't like it, you can switch it to a different box. So it is a customizable um, subscription or membership as they call it on the Bespoke Post website. Um, so they give you a quiz or a profile quiz when you sign up so that they have an idea of what you like and what you don't like. And I choose not to read my emails from them. <laughs> I'm ghosting them, <laughs> but I choose not to see what they've chosen for me simply because I'm just curious what it is that they've, they've picked for me um, based on the, my profile quiz that I did with them. So let's dig into this. Uh, this box is advertised as being for anybody. Basically everybody can, will have something in this box that they will like. So let's see, let's get this open and see what we got. This is the March box. And again, this box was based on my profile. So if you get bespoke posts, you may actually get something different based on your profile. So I'm opening this for the first time. I have no idea what is in here. As I said, I did not look at the emails when they um, emailed me to let me know which box they were sending. So let's see. Okay. Your trail box is here. Oh, cool. This is a perfect time for this. Um, to, to me, we'll get into it, but to me, this says maybe it's something for, for the outdoors, maybe hiking or camping or something like that. Um, so perfect time of year. And on the back, um, it has a QR code here on this little postcard. And I'm assuming this probably has information about all of the items in this box. They, they must not send you a catalog or a like a product booklet with it. You must have to um, scan your QR code to, to look at it. But here's what my card looks like that they sent me. And I can see it does say what is in here. So let's see. And I'm trying not to look. I want to be surprised. I always want to give you my honest first impression when I open these. So it looks like a little toolbox that's come out. So here it is. This is a nice toolbox, by the way. It's It feels like it's plastic, but it feels like it's really well made. Here we go. And you see, you can see it's held together by this metal uh, handle here. 
So let's get this open. I can always ha do something with these handy dandy little boxes. Um, I can always find some purpose for them. Commando wire saw, stainless steel wire with nylon hand straps. Now, this will, I don't even need this for camping. This will come handy for lawn work around, around the house. Uh, we live on a lake and um, some of the weeds that grow up around the lake are just, they're not, you can't just pull them out of the ground. They're like little trees, even though they're not a tree, they're a weed. Um, you can't just easily pull them out. So this will come in handy just for at home uses. My husband is going to love this. <laughs> I can tell you that right now. Very unique item to get. And then a book, Surviving the Great Outdoors. Everything you need to know before heading into the wild and how to get back in one piece. I just got something like this for my college student, how to kind of a how to survive in the wild type of a book, just for him. He's been having an itch to go camping lately. So of course not with, he, you know, he's a college student, so he doesn't have any money, but he wants to use all of our gear, of course, so, which we will let him if he wants to go camping. Sadly, I have to make sure he knows how to put the tent up before he goes. <laughs> we'll, we'll be practicing that one day in our backyard. But this is neat. I love it. Let me see if I can just pull a page. Um, should, <laughs> should I feed animals in the wild is one of, <laughs> one of the questions. And I don't, even, I don't even think I have to read that. I, I'm pretty sure I know the answer is no. <laughs> don't feed the animals. I live in um, Florida, so our lake has alligators in it, and we're always told in Florida, don't feed the alligators because they will become used to humans, and then when they're not afraid of humans, that's when people get attacked and bit. So um, we do not feed wild animals around here. Okay, this looks like... Um, it's either a, a bracelet or a handle. Let me see if I can get this out of the package so you can see it closer. Okay. So it's, um, it's not braided, but it's like a macrame and um, very, very sturdy. It could, it, this could very well be a bracelet for um, camping, or you, this might be a handle to something in here. Let me see if it says on here. It does not say on my little paper here. But to me, this seems like it, it's a really neat little outdoorsy hiking style bracelet with a nice little clasp right there. I think I would definitely wear this, but I think my husband is probably the one that's going to steal this from me, and he's probably going to be the one wearing it around. This is really nice. It's very, very thick and well-made. This. we got here. I think this is the last item in this neat little box. All right, this is packaged very, very well. So let's see. 
I'm feeling like this might be a fishing knife. So I'm being extra careful. I don't want to cut myself. Okay, here's a sheath to protect yourself. It's got a nice little button here, a little snap to hold your knife in place. And it has a little cutout here so you can hang it on your belt. The knife is in here. I'm trying to be really careful, but it's, let me get my scissors. I don't want to cut myself. The knife is protected in here. I can see it's got um, like a little plastic covering on it so that you don't cut yourself. But with my luck, I could I could probably cut myself. Here we go. There we go. All right. So this this is a nice knife. This is a nice. It's a it's a heavy knife. This is not a like a toy. This is a real knife. It's got a nice wooden handle and a very thick. This is the back, this is not the sharp side. A very thick blade. It has this little protective um, plastic on the front here. And this edge right here, I don't wanna to touch it. That's the sharp, sharp edge. So let me turn it so you can see that it is sharp. But this is a, a nice, heavy, well-made knife. And see, says it's a gut hook knife. So I am guessing that this could be used for fishing or hunting and to clean, clean your catch. This is really, really nice. Well, this is a cool, um, little box. Everything in here is very useful. I have a feeling my husband will be using most of these items and that is fine with me. Everything in here is really well made and nice. Um, it comes in this nice handy dandy little, um, I'm going to call it a toolbox <laughs> um, or an outdoors box. But um, we may not even keep this in the box. We may keep this with our lawn items, but um, my husband is going to love these items. And I might just take this book and use it as a gift for my younger son. Since my older son has a book like this, I might use this as a gift for my younger son. It's always good to have outdoor skills. And as a family, we actually hike quite a bit and we have camped too. Um, so uh, these items will come in very handy. So this was an interesting March box. I think it was good for the season. And I remember when I filled out my uh, profile, I did say that the that I enjoyed the outdoors. So, um, so there, um, doing two for two since this is my second um, box. Very good items in both. So far, Bespoke Post has sent very high quality items. I've been very impressed with the items they have sent. So um, it's Bespoke Post, so you can go check them out, bespokepost.com, and you can find out more information about their membership and how it works. This is my subscription box life. I will put my social media down in the details, and I also have a blog, um, mysubscriptionboxlife.com, where I will take up close pictures of everything in this box if you wanna um, take a look closer look at everything. I will post that to my blog. Um, I have another really cool box coming up for you, so stick around. I'm glad that you could join me today.